Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. みなさん、こんにちは。えー、今日は TOFL とか SAT とか大学留学、海外の大学に留学するときの TOFL、IELTS の勉強の仕方、どうやって TOFL、IBT93 点を63点から取ったのかっていうのをね、やりたいと思うんだけど。So today's video is going to be about how I got TOEFL IBT 93, I think on 94,、um, and how I increased my TOEFL score from my first score, which was 63 or 64, to in 94, 93. Like I increased the score by 30 points. And how I studied English when I was just graduating from high school. So, the most important thing that I always talk about when it comes to studying for TOEFL or IELTS, when it comes to preparing yourself for、uh, university in like Western country, is vocabulary. Vocabulary is always important because this, you know, words, words, cons- you know, that, in- that at the end of the day, you know, everything that you're gonna read consists of. Paragraphs and paragraphs consist of sentences, and the sentences consist of phrases, and the phrases eventually consist of vocabularies. Vocabulary, vocabularies, 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 you know, which means word. And if you can understand or understand or guess the meaning of、uh, each word or some of the main keywords in a sentence, It is much easier for you to predict what they are trying to convey in a, in a sentence or paragraph. So I have Amazon.ca or Amazon.com here open on my browser. And the way I like to study English vocabulary is to associate w o r d with some kind of like, you know, sound, rhythm, and even like, you know, lines, jokes. Um, if it's better, I want to see some animated picture so that it's easier for me to register the meaning of word in my brain. And everybody has different k i n d of learning style. Some people are better at learning by reading, other people like to learn from writing, speaking, listening, and、uh, other people like to. Gets their,、uh, the other people like to get their hands dirty, which means you know, kinesthetic. Kinesthetic meaning involving body and moving around. I like to do、uh, kinesthetic and、uh, actual, like I like to learn by doing it. So, so for me, it's really hard to just look at a list of words and then look at definitions of words and then try to make sense of it because it's really hard for my brain. To associate. And visualizing is really key when it comes to learning vocabularies because it can get really boring and tedious. So, it is for me about how to make it more entertaining, how to make it more easy and intuitive. And then here you go, I have three book recommendations for you to study TOEFL. And、uh, I don't have a、uh, vocabulary for.、Um, SAT because when you are studying for TOEFL, it's a little bit too difficult. But、uh, vocabulary cartoon is the original uh, original uh, textbook or reference book that I bought and I used to study for SAT, which means SAT is a little bit more difficult than TOEFL. So when you study SAT, you don't automatically cover. Um, uh, TOEFL vocabulary list as well. But this SAT is a little too difficult, and that's the reason why. If you're around like an Aiken EQ or Aiken Jun EQ or Aiken San Q, then I would start with grade 2 or 3 vocabulary cartoon of the day for grades 2 and 3. 180 reproducible cartoons. And let's look inside. You think you know, English vocabularies for grade 2 and 3 are too easy for you, right? But probably not. Most of you guys want to relearn、uh, definitions of words for even elementary school students in Western countries. So you can take a look 
inside this book. It's loading up quite slow. Vocabulary cartoons, word power made easy. This is 200, 210 words. Every grammar, every grammar school students should know. It. So this is a little bit more difficult than grade 10 3. And this is 180 reproducible cartoons that help kids build robust and prodigious vocabulary. See, I don't even know what this prodig prodig prodigious. I don't know what that means. Pro prodigious. Remarkably or impressively great. Anyways, should be loading right now. Okay, so I'll explain to you what I mean by learning by visualizing the meaning of word. Alright, it's easier for you. And then if I, you know, when I, I looked at these words here, and then I guess that some of the high school students in Japan probably have a hard time understanding it. Some of the style. Adventure is pretty easy, right? Adventure is alert, ancestor, senzo, ancestor, attention, chimok, bargain, waribiki, beverage, beverage is no yoro. Border, Kyokai, Castle, Show, Catalog, Challenge, Clearing, Cluster. Probably people, some people don't know about Cluster. Cluster, when you are a student, you are a student, you are a student. Commotion, this is what you are Contest, Conversation, Cooperation, 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 Course, Craving. Probably people don't know about the meaning craving. I crave this and I crave that. Hosuruti. Creature, Ikimono, Kore Saves Dekane, Damage, Deck, Deck Dene, Patio, Be an Patio, De, Patio, Tareo, Patio, De, no, Living Janakte, Living Sotonia, yes, no. Echo, Age, Effort, Elders, Errands, people probably don't know about errands. I need to run for errands, Timon, I need to run for errands. Chotto Soto de, Chotto Yojigaru Karate, Expert, Expression, Fabric, Chloe, I don't know what this means, Glare, Harvest, Harvest plants, the harvest plants. So, good Helmet, instinct, natural instinct, honno, insult, or insult. I didn't mean to insult you. Insult, then, choose Kitchen, lunch, league, length, majority, opinion, outcome. This is important. Outcome of economic activity. Outcome, take patch. Patch the shoes and software no patch the Or oh, I needed I added a patch to this bag in software. Patch shoes and present again. Region royalty scene scowl shadow shadow kage squeak squeaking sound of door squeaking sound stranger strategy stride stride symbol text transition wisp I don't know adore I adore you dinner. Assemble, assembly line, Assem conveyor belt, assembly line, kumitate, bloom, hanaga mankai nanto, bloom, bore, bundle, circle, clutch, complain, concentrate, concentrate, you should concentrate on studying uh, vocabulary for top, chu chu shina, convince. Uh, I don't want to convince you to study top four vocabularies using this book. You can you can pick whatever you want. I don't mean to convince you to pick this one necessarily. Convince set to delve into. I need to delve into this issue. Depart, depart, departure in the airport, right? Depart, but disappear, disguise. You know, some people disguise themselves as if they are somebody else. Disguise, ne? あの、ディス、嘘をつくじゃないけど、ちょっと仮面をかぶるみたいなそういうね。で、今言ってるように、俺日本語の単語が出てこないよね。英語を英語でもう学んで、英語の英語でルックアップしてディフィニッションを英語
you know, if you run for a long time, you are building endurance in your muscle. Endurance, knee tight, right? Forbid. Forbidden. You know, bringing cell phone is forbidden in this building. Forbidden to keep certain. Gasp, gather, hitch, hurl, ignore, ignore, that means imitate, minus insist. I insist that you study vocabularies for English before coming to uh, Western University. Mumble, mumble, Predict, predict. Prediction of Japanese economy is really bad. Predict, prod, protect, quench, realize, recognize. You know, these vocabularies, most of the kind of verbs here, are quite important. These are like really basic words that you're gonna see a lot when you are reading newspapers and articles and so you want to master these vocabularies which are for grade 2 and start for local English students before studying for TOEFL because you know why? Because these are fundamental most basic uh, vocabularies that you really need to understand. Right? Swell. So, my throat is swollen. Swell to fukuramu to Utilize. Utilize is very important. You need to utilize your time because time is limited. Utilize. Saiko koritsu yoku ryo suru. Venture. I want to venture out outside the world. Venture out. Then I bokin suru mi tenare. Wanda. World. World. This. Kukuru kuru kuru ti. World. Wobble. Wobble, 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 wreck, wreck, これ知ってるよ wrecking ball, the musician song, ne? wrecking ball, uh, yield, you need to yield your way to strangers, yield, the yuzuruti, bilingual, bleak, boostful, bastard, I don't know, cautious, you need to be cautious about, you need to be cautious about what major you want to study in university because some majors don't get you any job, cautious. Seasons. Clever, confident, considerate, omoyori concern. Curious, decent, defiant. Many young people are defiant these days. でね。ってことでまあ、これをとりあえずね、最初にね、やるべきだと思う。みんながみんなね、あの、英検準1級、英検準1級持ってても、2級持ってても、今でさえね、例えばたまにね、わかんないのがあるからもう、ペリシャ
you know, let's say look at the uh, word abduct. Definition is to kidnap or carry off by force. Sound like duck. Label ne. This is a sample sentence. Abducted ducks. And これが本いるね Associate, visualize, picture, image, picture with some words. ね Abducted ducks. ね rap みたいなね単語のねダジャレじゃないけど Abducted duck. ね kidnap って書いてあるからこれ誘拐されるとかね誘拐するとかね無理やり引きずっていくみたいなこれは絵にあるように。誘拐されてるダックで音がねアブダクトとダックが似てるからアブダクトダックっていうねアブダクトを見たらダックをあの連想すればあアブダクトダックでこの絵があったなって思い出してあ誘拐されたって意味か誘拐するってことになるっていうふうにできる Right So other ones、uh, Let's see、um, Is inhabit Sounds like rabbit The example sentence Rabbits inhabit holes. Rabbits inhabit holes. Rabbits inhabit holes. What does it mean? It means to live or dwell in. So, u s a g i ga s u n d e i r u a n a t i mitene. Oto ga ni teru kara ne. Rabbit inhabits in a hole. Mitene kanji ne. Gold. To urge, prick, or push. Sounds like a toad. Never gold a big toad. Kaeru kana? Kore. カエルに無理やりね、要求するなみたいな。強引にするなみたいな。ファートル。ファートル。sounds like a turtle. definition: able to reproduce children, seeds, or fruits. highly productive. example: a fertile turtle. fertile turtle. 絵を見るとね、めちゃめちゃ子供がいるよねってことで。definition 的には reproduce だから子孫を残すとかね。その、そういう意味。子供とか種とか。で、fertile turtle. 音でめっちゃ覚えやすいでしょこれファロータロンってそんな感じで覚えやすい encroach sounds like roach roaches will encroach whenever wherever there is food definition to intrude gradually upon the rights of another to trap us roaches will encroach ゴキブリがねじわじわとね侵入してくるよみたいな smitten kitten A smitten kitten. Very much in love. めちゃめちゃね、こう、恋しちゃって、恋っていうかね、much in love. な、キットって、キットって小さい子、ね、小さい子猫。A rude, like rude. So, this is a really easy way, and this is the best way for me to learn vocabulary. It's easy. I can just associate word with picture. Same as this guy, vocabulary cartoon, they 180 to produce a cartoon for kids. Probably this is a little more academic because it says prodigious. Prodigious or prodigious. Come on. And that's pretty much it, guys.、Um, uh, pretty much these are going to cover a lot of words that you're going to learn when you study for TOEFL. Oh, this one's pretty. I guess. Yeah, this is definitely for TOEFL. This is definitely more academic right now because I can tell because I study for these words. Confound. To confound means to confuse or mix someone up. This school map you drew might confound one st our students considering it's a school in ancient Egypt. Confound. No, confuse doesn't matter yet. Misconstrue. To misconstrue means to get the wrong idea about something. Kono ne. Gokai o umu mite. Oblivious. This is, you know, all of these keywords. Are、uh, quite you know, academic, you will definitely come across these vocabularies in the TOEFL. Oblivious. A person who is oblivious it does not know or is not aware of what's happening. When it comes to what's cool, my dad gets it, but my mom is so oblivious. この認識がないっていうの。忘れてるとか認識がないとか、見えてないっていうの。見る目がない。Canny. Someone who is canny is clever or smart. You don't have to be too canny to outsmart this cat. Cat, canny, cat, can. You don't have to be too smart to, you, you don't have to be too canny to outsmart this cat. めちゃめちゃね、頭がいいとかね、図の名跡とかそういう。And if you do that, probably you're gonna be good to go. And this is SAT, which is on a whole level. This is really hard. You don't need to study if you just study for TOEFL. I'll just show you. I don't even know most of these 
I don't even see these words when I abhor hate so much. I abhor chore, didn't it? Abominate, abomi, abom hate, to dislike strongly. I abominate bombs. I abominate not any news. The middle of the one I kiss it. A bridge, a bridge, bridge, didn't it? Or show you excited to one. Hanbun ni not any bridge, didn't it? Middle of the one. Abstruse mo middle of the one. Hard to understand. Moose is very abstruse. Kono moose wa ne mecha mecha ni kai shiga tai mite. Abatto middle of the one ne. Abyss wa ne abyss mo didn't it? So ko. Abysmal. The diver, the diver missed the ledge and then sank deep into abyss. Accolade. Abjunct. Abjunct mo mina yne. Konna no researcher ぐらいしか使わないんじゃない。文学系の。Affidavit mo mina yne. 誓約書。Affidavit. Affinity mo mina yne. Affinity で関連性なるみたい。親近性があるみたい。Natural attraction, kinship, similarity. Affinity for shark fin soup and shark fin tea. Shark finty affinity. Aftermath. これがね、あとあとの散々の結果残骸みたいな events for example から少し aftermath. Aftermath. Aggrandize みたいなことね。Ajar もみたいな。Alien ね、ちょっと見るね。ちょっと阻害するみたいな。あのちょっと離れていくみたいなね。距離を置くみたいな。To make hot step to cause fear. Alien eight. Alleviate みたいな。Alleviate って。こう楽にするタックスアリビエーションみたいな楽にする。アドゥア、アドゥアピーポーイントゥーティンクみたいなね。この,この魅,力魅,力魅力するとかね、ちょっとこう,こうやって引いていくみたいな。アドゥーフってね、この傲慢なとか。そういう感じで、オルタケーションもこう呼んだね。オルタケーション。オルタナティブ。これあの代替のとか、ね、代わりになるって。こうやって。あのダジャレみたいなのが覚えられるからね。アンビエンスってね、こう、アンビエントミュージックっていうじゃん、アンビエントって、このゆったりしたみたいな。Mood, feeling, general atmosphere. George did not enjoy the ambience in the ambience. 要は、証拠者の中の雰囲気を好きじゃなかったって書いてある。アンビエンス、in ambience って覚えやすいね。アメナボーって友好的な。Agreeable, responsible, authority, pleasant. Amenable to the mean ball. So, antecedent, anterior, interior, appalling, the big crystal, big clock, appalling, aptitude, learning aptitude, archaic, the old school, the old school, archaic way of learning, artisan, what am I saying? Artisan, music, or so on. Askew Aspire を見るね。Asrage わかんねえな。Astute ってね。頭が切れるとか迷彩なとかね。Assert 見ないな。<笑> Atrophy ってね、こう、こう、ちょっとずつ劣化していくっていう、ね、生物とかでよく見る Atrophy。ソフトウェアでも。Atypical 普通じゃないって。A って反対語だから、ね。Atypical。Typical ではない。So that's it, guys.、Uh, you can、uh, check out these and then learn. Pretty much, you know, easy. Just read, watch, you know, look at the you know, animated you know, image and associate. That's it, guys. That's it. Hope this uh, uh, helped you in a way that you can、uh, find, you know, you can improve your way of studying English.、Um, if you have any questions, let me know. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.